Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? Today is September 19th, 2009, Saturday, and I have a review to do for you guys uh, of a product from AccessoryGeeks.com, link in the video description. But before I go ahead and get into this, I want to give a quick shout out, actually two quick shout outs. One, going to Simple SDK, where if you guys want to know anything about SDK and making your own application or anything like that, this is the person that you need to go ahead and check out, the link over there. And also Epic iPods. Epic iPods is like will also be over there. Um, he has some really cool reviews, updates, and giveaways as well. So make sure you go ahead and check him out um, and subscribe to both of them if you like what they're doing. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into this. Hey guys, so what's up? How are you guys doing today? Um, I have the review for you guys of the Spider Pig iPod speaker system slash FM radio from AccessoryGeeks.com. I know, funny name, Spider Pig, ha ha ha. But, um, it actually looks like him, doesn't it? No. But uh, this uh, speaker system also doubles as an FM radio, as you can probably tell by the title. Uh, it retails for $19.99 on AccessoryGeeks.com. Uh, it's got some really great sound, like I said, the FM radio as well, which gives it a little extra boost that didn't even need it, um, but it went ahead, gave it a little extra um, a little more of incentive to make somebody want to purchase this item, so that was really cool that they threw in a FM uh, radio speaker or an FM radio tuner. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and just bring you guys down here really quick. We And we're going to go ahead and just take a closer look at the speaker system itself. Okay, okay. Okay, so you guys can see I have the white one. I also believe they have it in a pink and possibly a yellow. The box is that they have it in a yellow, but I don't know if I saw the yellow on their website. So if you're not really interested in this white, definitely go ahead and check out Accessory Geeks and see if you can find yourself a different color. Okay, so on the front, you get right there, you have your little speaker there with the nose of the, or the snout of the pig. You guys can see one's a little bit smaller than the other one. That's actually pretty neat because then it looks like it's shooting out at you. A um, little chip right there, nothing major. Uh, I'll move it up to the top here. You guys see so you have two little like sad eyes. It's actually pretty funny. Makes it look really cute. Um, over here on this side, this ear, when you press that in, it's a scan button. So it'll scan through the stations. And this button, this ear, will reset it. And you can go back and start scanning through again if you want. Um, knock that over. Um, go ahead and turn it to the back. In the unboxing video, a lot of you guys found this funny, and you know what? It is kind of funny. Um, here you have the cable which goes to the USB cable, which right now I have plugged into the wall via USB outlet. Um, so you can plug this into your computer, you can plug it into a laptop, anything that you can plug and power a USB powered device into, and it will work. Um, regular USB, so right there, this does not come out. So it's just that one USB cord, so you're good with that. Um, and here is where you can plug in your line in, line out, or audio in, audio out jack right into its butt. Um, they do supply you with this white cable right here, so you can plug it into your here, then plug it into, you could say a computer, a different number three player, or in this case, your iPod. Okay, so we'll do that in a second. Uh, then the tail uh, acts at, acts, excuse me, as the volume switch and the on and off switch. You guys didn't hear that click? That click is on and off, on and off. Uh, so you just want to have it off and keep it plugged in. Just go ahead, shut it off. Not going to be using power. And you can just leave your, there, leave your uh, pig there for show. Um, you guys know I reviewed an iPad and I have an iPig. So now I have like a little iFarm of speakers. Kind of funny. But anyway, um, volume does go up pretty high. You guys can see the tail will go all the way back down here and make the volume go as high as possible. And then low as possible. And then shut off. Um, let's go ahead and move on to the bottom down here. You have, let me move that cable out of the way, you have the four feet that it stands on, so it's not just the bottom that's going to be able to roll around and get knocked over, it is pretty sturdy, um, you yes, see it is pretty sturdy, shaking the desk there, it is pretty sturdy with those four feet, uh, in between all those four feet is a little battery compartment, and in here the box says that uh, you can, let me see if I can get that in there, the box says it works on four AA batteries, 4 AA batteries are not going to fit in there. Um, that's spot for, for AAA batteries. So if you don't want to have this plugged in and you want to take it somewhere, take it in a car, take it outside while you're doing something, go ahead and power it up using 4 AAA batteries. Go ahead and put the cover back on. So this works as an awesome portable FM radio as well as a portable speaker system. Okay. 
Now let's get into what you guys really came here for, the sound. Um, I'm not going to show you guys the radio, uh, copyright, obviously. So I'm going to show you guys a couple of songs I have here on my iPod. If you are interested in any of the songs that you hear, there will be a link in the video description. Go ahead and download them on iTunes. Um, this person's name, let's see if I can get that in there, is Andrew Seistrup. Um, right there, good friend of mine. So definitely go ahead, and if you're interested in any of the music that you hear, definitely go over on, on iTunes and purchase a song or two, maybe the whole album. Hmm, you never know. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and plug this into his butt. Bet he's liking that. Um, <laughs> so now we're just going to go ahead and then plug the other end into my iPod right down there. Go ahead and bring this around the front. And now all you have to do is you turn your uh, uh, little iPig on or whatever you guys want to call it. Spider pig iPod speaker. Um, and just go ahead. Click play. And you guys should see that it does have some really nice sound. You can turn the volume up on here, or you can turn the volume up on your iPhone or iPod Touch or your other MP3 player or the other audio device that you're using to uh, give sound to this. Uh, whichever one, it's up to you. You guys can see right there when the tail's all at the end, or just a little bit before the end, uh, the sound just started to get a little bit crinkly. Let me show you guys. You guys should hear that how the sound kind of tries to push too much, so it gets all fuzzy and stuff like that. You don't really need to worry about that because just with the tail about halfway um, lined up at the front, it sounds really great. It's pretty loud. It may not sound that loud to you guys, but it's actually really loud. It's definitely filling up the whole room that I'm in right now with sound. Definitely hear it from the living room too, which is a couple floors down. Um, one floor down, but um, it actually has some really great sound. Obviously, um, it's twenty twenty dollars, so you're not going to be getting iPanda type of sound out of this uh, item, but you're going to be getting some really good sound. Let's go ahead and listen to a couple more. Uh, by the way, the name of the song is Crazy. I do have permission to use this song and all that jazz, so definitely go ahead and check it out on iTunes. So you guys can see that this thing does have some really great sound, uh, obviously not turned up all the way, and it also has a really cool look to it with the white glossy finish to the top, um, also with the cool little cute little panda speaking, uh, panda, wow, I don't know, uh, it's a pig, uh, with the cute little pig face right there, it's like all sad and then it's got to push out the sound, I think it's pretty cute, funny at the same time, and also has some really great sound. For $19.99 guys, you can't go wrong with this product, this is definitely something you need to go ahead and check out, um, once again, Andrew Sice up crazy the name of the song is definitely going to check out this artist on itunes great stuff purchase some stuff if you're interested link over there thank you um okay guys so that's all i got for you guys for this review great product 1999 you can't go wrong and you also get a little fm tuner inside so you can listen to your favorite radio station on the go um one quick thing the only flaw that I have with this product is obviously the sound if you turn it all the way up but for 1999 you're going to be getting that little bit of a flaw um the left ear a little bit wobbly. You see the reset button? It's stiff. It's in there. It's not really going to move. This one will move freely. And you kind of have to push down and then back. You guys can hear that click almost. You have to push down and then back to get that click to work. Um, this one you can just push it in. I think that it's just with this product. It seems like just a, a product flaw in this one uh, device. I don't think it'll be in all of them. But that's the only thing I thought of that you guys know that I found wrong with this product. So thanks for watching, guys. Uh, all the links you will need in the sidebar. Favorite, comment, rate, subscribe, and I will catch you. Hey, guys. Back at you here. One more quick thing. Name of this song, by the way, Destiny. Also on Andrew Sysup's album in iTunes. Um... Giveaway on this iKit case right here on this holster works with the iPhone and iPod touch Definitely go ahead and check this out
Um, this is going to be a giveaway, guys. So all you gotta do to get in on this, be subscribed, rate this video, favorite this video, and comment. I kit dash your comment. Comment as many times as you want. It's up to you guys. Winner will be chosen in a matter of a week or a couple days. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will catch you all in my next video. Uh, favorite, comment, rate, subscribe. Everybody have a wonderful day, and I will see you all later. Peace. Definitely go and check out this artist on iTunes. Link in the video description. Good luck.